Saturday Social is powered by EA Sports FIFA 23 with PlayStation. But we're going to move on now to true or mm. false. Rules are very simple. Our guests have got a paddle that says true or false. Yep. We're going to read out a statement. You've got to reveal your paddle and then explain why within the 60 second time limit. They are all World first. Cup related. Yeah, they first are. up, Brazil are the biggest underachievers in this World Cup. True or false? Oof. What are you saying? False. False. Now, Abby was, false. Abby was on the fence. On the fence. She went I'm through. on the fence. That's false. 60 seconds on the clock. Abby, why false? Yes and no. They are because obviously they were the favourites, if not one of the favourites. But I also think you've got to look at Belgium. For me, again, end of that golden generation. Really, really poor. The in house fighting as well. Um, I think Canada were disappointing. I think there's been quite a few disappointing teams. Uh, and Denmark for me, another one that was really disappointing after their. Kind of so they're slightly Euros. higher up in the underachievers than Brazil, slightly for you. Yeah, I mean, Brazil have been disappointing, but I think they're not the only team that's been the biggest. Hi. Germany, I think, for mm. me, are probably the biggest. Not getting out the, Just not getting out of the group, I think, was madness. Absolute madness. I mean, no disrespect to Japan and Costa Rica, but aside of that, I mean, they've still got some quality, quality players mm. in there. I'm really, really shocked they didn't. Naturally, Brazil, people expect them to win it, but, yeah, the Germans, I think... German's biggest underachievers. Yeah, I you. think so. Yeah. Literally okay. not getting out what of the group. About Spain? I was going to mention yeah, Spain. Yeah. Yeah. Spain. Some big nations Spain out of really. yeah. Morocco. Yeah. With their quality in that midfield, I, especially. I just think it was more of a shock than not get, literally not getting out of a group with Japan and Costa Rica in it. Okay, perfect okay. timing. Fair enough. Let's move on to the next one. Uh, and obviously, it's about Lionel Messi. Mm. And this one's very simple. Messi is going to be the player of the tournament. True or Ooh. false? See the paddles? False. False. A pair of falses. Whoa. That's a brave call. Pi, we'll come to you first this time. Yeah, like, it, do you know what it is? It's a, uh, do I think they'll give it to him? Yes, but I don't think he deserves uh, He's been, obviously he's been quality, but I think Bruno, uh, Fernandez, Mbappe and Bellingham have been better. Like, I do think they've been better. It's just, it was even with the game on. <laughs> Messi's like six passes before they've done something and it's all that started with Messi. It's just everything is back to Messi. I know people do it with Ronaldo as well, but it's legitimately everything is down to Messi. You know, every moment is Messi. Like, even when they're celebrating, it's like the camera's panning to Messi who's not even, in, you know, involved. Mm. Do you know what I mean? It's, I just think the media will do everything they can to give it to him. I totally agree. I was going to let him carry on because he, <laughs> everything I was going to say, you've said. And I think that if they get to the final and if they win it, then obviously, you know, you can probably say that would be true. But they, they are doing everything they can to make this amazing story where he basically completes football. Yeah, yeah. even the ref yesterday. I mean, the ref basically wanted his shirt. Didn't yeah. He was so bad. <laughs> he was yeah. so bad. The ref was horrendous. Yeah. He was, there was a moment where Messi, like, punched the ball mid-air and the ref was just like, play on. Yeah. Play a lot of cameras on Messi. I know what time is the end of the game. Painful. The scene's over there and it's this camera on Messi. Uh, right, next up, true or false, Portugal are better without Ronaldo in the starting lineup. Abby was straight away with her paddle there. You say true. Yeah. Very quick. Why do you say true? Firstly, I'm a very big Ronaldo fan, but I think there comes a time where you have to step back and let the new era and new generation take over. They were unbelievable the other night against um, Switzerland. Quite possibly one of my favourite performances of the tournament. They were just like scintillating. Yeah. They were free flowing. I mean, Gonzalo Ramos, what? An introduction. Wow. I mean, he was out of this world, but yeah, Felix, Liao, also having a great, uh, great tournament. Bruno Fernandes. Bruno, as well. Bruno yeah. Fernandes, Otavio. They've just had so many good players, and I think they play much more as a team, as a squad, with way more fluidity when Ronaldo's not in there. And they've got the talent, so don't need Ronaldo anymore. You agree? Uh, yeah, I think that's a perfect summary, really. I mean, as, 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 as well, I am someone that does really, really like Ronaldo, but I think the last sort of should we say, a few months, you can see... It, it, it's kind of got a bit rapid, I think. It, it was always slow. And now, it, it's almost sad to see. I feel like Messi's kind of almost going out... I mean, as I say, I know I mentioned that everything's on Messi, but maybe with a bit more glory, whereas it kind of seems like Ronaldo... I don't know. I don't like the way it's ending. It feels like it's... It's, it's a bit bitter, isn't it? Yeah, it feels it is, like it should it be a spectacular... Yeah, it's a little bit bitter. Uh, let's go on to our next one, then. We have to talk about Morocco, because yeah, what a wow. stunning World Cup they've Brilliant. had. And this one's very simple. Morocco will be the first African team ever to make a World Cup final. Both false. They are having a, some time. They can see one goal. It was an own goal. Yeah, Pie. yeah I, I, I like them, and I like the way I like the way they play football. They kind of play with, like, no fit. I, I'm a big Ziyech fan. I, I said this before when, he, when, I, when I seen him play live. I mean... Granted, it was against Argyle, but the way he moved the ball. <laughs> granted, it was, but the way Slip he moves, it still doesn't, yeah, it still and doesn't change. And you performance fact, that day. It still doesn't change the fact that the way he moves the ball. I know he's very one footed, but the way he crosses and moves the ball, it's very good to watch. Like I think, and, and what I've seen him play, though, I do think he actually is a really good footballer. They've got heart. I just think Portugal 
probably too good if they play like they did the other day. But they, they, they've got a chance. Bono in goal as well is, is, is hard to beat. Yeah, Amrabat's been amazing. Yeah, well. Amrabat, um, Hakimi as well. I mean, we know how good he is. You yeah. mentioned Ziyech too and uh, Bono in goal. They've been so, so good. Um, and I would love it, of course, if they did not Portugal out. But like I said in the question before, I think Portugal have got such a good squad. There's, I just can't. I think it might be a step too far. So you don't yeah. think it'll be a beautiful day for Bono? No. <laughs> I'm rooting for them. That, that, that was good. That was very good. Thank you. Yeah, 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 like, I'm rooting for them, though. I'm worried. That. <laughs> that was very good. For Thank you. Really I just thought of it. Um, anyway, that completes our... Have we got one more? We've got one more. We've Sorry. Got one more. Uh, last one. So Trill excited balls. about his own joke. <laughs> he's that so he's happy. forgotten the final. So Southgate yeah. should stay as England manager, even if they lose to France. True or false? Let's see your paddles. Oh, we've got disagreement on this one. OK, so you're going true, Abby, why true? I'm going true because I don't think there's anyone better to do the job at this moment in time. Like I said, I'm a big fan of him. I think he's done a lot. Yes, if we, you know, lose another final, there will be questions, and I get that, especially with the squad we've got. But I don't see who else could come in and do a better job than he's doing at this moment in time. If, if you could give me someone, then maybe that's a different question, but of who I can think of who would come in. People have said Pochettino would take over. I genuinely don't believe Pochettino would take over that job. And I really don't. I think he still wants to be in club football and management. Or if it was Argentina national team, I don't see it happening for England. Part you disagree? I disagree, but I am waver. I'm not. I, it's. It's. I think it's all down to performance. It depends. Obviously, if we lose, but we we play well. We. You know, the, the, the approach to the game is good. You can say fair play. We've lost to you know one of the world's team, greatest yeah. sides. But if he comes, it, it's the way he approaches the game. I think. I just think if we do lose, I think I, I would want to see a different approach to England going forward. Yeah, the harmony is there. I agree with that. You're dead right. The, the, the squad harmony really is there. But I just think he's got almost everything, and I think the right manager will 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 produce results with it.